marriage. A hopeful, generous, infinitely kind gamble taken by two people who don't yet know who they are or who they might become, binding themselves to a future they cannot conceive of and have carefully omitted to investigate together. Woke up with the world in your eyes, sure as the light of the morning. Look up now to cloud. For those who might not know, Nick and Adelaide's love story has been a very long one. We might call it more of a novel. When you came These two are the loved up high school sweethearts, lucky enough to have met the one when they were only 16. Adelaide. Our journey together would already be considered by most to be long, but we've got a while to go. We've shared half of our lives with each other, yet there still remains so much we haven't undone. These facts continue to remind me that it has been time that has bound our love. Love that grows deeper each day. A definition of us that means when we're apart, we are not truly whole. Today, I promise to always support you and to care for you. I promise to keep our lives exciting and adventurous. I promise to one day buy you a schnauzer and to tolerate your obsession with indoor plants. I promise to work at our love and always make you a priority in my life. Finally, I promise to always love you and make it worth you loving me in return. Unlike everyone else, I, I didn't meet Nick at Pipe Band. The Pipe Band in Bagpipe. Pipe Band. Pipe Major, the PLC Pipe Band. We met through the Pipe Band. Our Pipe Major was dating the Scotch College Pipe Sergeant. As a matter of interest, Adelaide and Nick are both accomplished pipers, albeit having never played together. Maybe tonight, tonight. Nick happened to meet a young lady who shared his interest in bagpipes. Her name was Adelaide. And 14 years on, we find ourselves here celebrating their marriage. It has been a long time coming. We'd like to start by sincerely thanking everyone for coming together and celebrating with us today. I know for a few of you it must have been really, really tough to take a Friday off work and enjoy a long weekend down south with the beautiful weather and the free alcohol and food that I've provided. So thank you all for your selfless effort. And I'm told he only knows one karaoke song, The Gambler by Kenny Rogers. This is an appropriate song, Nick, for tonight in Adelaide, you have found an ace you can keep up. I feel extremely privileged that Nick and Ads have allowed, I mean, sorry, Nicky Poo Poo and Ads have allowed me to be part of their special day. It's a great honour to be invited, let alone stand up here beside you guys and hopefully say some nice enough words. Through all these silly buggers and weekends with the boys, there's been one constant, and that's Adelaide. You two helped me believe in love and happiness, as this is all I can see when you two are together. You guys are two of my best friends and two of the all-time greats in my eyes. This is one of the quotes that Nick uses all the time and I just thought that it was appropriate to put it on a t-shirt. I never dreamed I'd end up being a son-in-law or a fucking awesome mother-in-law. Here I am, living the dream. <laughs> You're officially a low lip. Unbelievable, my baby girl that always danced in her little plastic shoes with her feathers and her hats and her handbag and more beads than a little body could carry has got to this point. It's, I'm so proud of you and I love you so much.
And now before I do a toast, a little, little surprise, I will force you to do this and everyone else is waiting. I, I decide I'd do it before the dance floor gets any dirty. Nick, this is it. We finally made it to our wedding day, only 5,072 days after you asked me to be your girlfriend. I was searching for an open door. I was looking for a peace of mind. After knowing each other for almost half of our lifetime, I still wake up each morning and think how lucky I am to be with you. We all know how indecisive I am, but if there's one decision that I know is the right one, it's to spend the rest of my life with you. You make me feel so safe and secure. You encourage and challenge me to be confident in everything that I do, but most of all, you make me feel incredibly special. Knowing how much family means to us and thinking about this wedding day for a long time, it wasn't the small details that I cared much about, but it was the man I'd be standing beside today. I always hoped to find a man that my family loved as much as I did. And it's seeing the way that my grandpa looks at you each and every time he sees you. I think you've got this one covered. I promise to always support your dreams as your happiness means the absolute world to me. I promise to always stand by your side, even during the rough times, knowing that we are stronger together and I promise to never stop noticing the little things you do for me as they constantly remind me why I love you so much. As I become your wife today, I most look forward to chasing our dreams, driving more open roads together, making amazing memories, and building our beautiful family together. I love you, and I'm so proud to now call you my husband. It gives me great pleasure to declare that you're now husband and wife. Nick, you may kiss your bride.